And this is how we assemble our very popular competitor trap. As you see, the trap is already assembled for you, the clip, the trigger, and we're just going to mount it to the frame. The bolt goes through all three pieces here. It's your washer, your lock washer, and your nut. That one in there, and then we got a two more here. Washer, lock washers, and nuts. Now we're going to mount the trap head to the frame. And put a bolt up here in the end, which is your pivot bolt. Put the bolt through the frame, or through the trap, and then through the frame. Same deal. Washer, lock washer, and a nut. You got a square head bolt that's going to go through both pieces. You got a washer and a lock washer, and then you have a wing nut. That'll be your adjuster here that you can change your elevation up and down. Now we're going to mount your spring. Slip it through your spring strap, either direction, doesn't make any difference. Slide it through your bolt hole in the back, put on your flat washer, and then put on your wing nut, spin that on all the way, and then what you want to do is you want to cinch this up enough that this arm is kind of tight out here in the end. And just put a little pressure on there, don't screw it all the way in, and then you're done ready to go. Now, to use this, we get a string here, you can put through this string hole so you can stand up and release it if you're by yourself, pull this back, your trigger spring. This comes with three ground stakes. What you're going to do is step on these and push these into the ground right to here on all three. And then you got your stakes that will drive in on top of that right here to ensure your trap stays in the ground for many more throws before you need to uh, replace it again into the ground. Now if you want to mount it to a tire, of course you won't need your ground stakes. All you're going to do is take your two bolts out that are in the inside right here roll this piece over, you can see you have two holes here and they'll bolt into those two. And then you have your back here, this will slide up onto your tire and you have your bolt hole here which will go down into your rim, tighten it up and now you're on your tire ready to uh, throw off the tire as opposed to staking it into the ground. And that's the full assembly of our competitor trap.